another beautiful game week on campus. I'm Taylor Peters with head coach Matt Wells. If you're watching Cartwells brought to you by Southwest Bank. Coach, how was your week, your weekend? My weekend? Yeah. Good, yeah. So when you're not coaching college football on a Saturday, are you watching college football? Or in your bye week, are you like trying to actually take a break? Recruiting all day Friday. And uh, Saturday started out with uh, Wyatt's first flag football game in the rain. Awesome. In the rain. Yeah, they played. He's down the Texans. What position does Wyatt play? Is he a quarterback? He plays QB. I yeah. knew it. Yeah, yeah. He had a good game. Two touchdowns. Overthrew oh a couple, but. Hey, that's okay. Uh, you win some, you lose yeah. some. Yeah. Nope. Yeah, they didn't lose them. They won. They won. Yep. His team won. Um, good job, good Wyatt. Good game. Did a little radio. 97.3, and then uh, spent part of the day, the rest of the day with the family and watching a little ball and, yeah. and uh, kind of kicking back with them a little bit. That is nice. Is your family excited that for the first time ever as a Texas Tech head coach, you're heading back to your home state there in Oklahoma? We have some friends and uh, cousins. And my mom will be there and some friends from uh, Salisaw, my hometown, and yeah. some, of my, some of my coaches. Did you grow up going to camps at OU, or was that something that, like, did you used to go, grow up going to games there? Yeah, I actually did both. Uh, my grandpa actually played basketball and, and uh, tennis at Oklahoma. Interesting. Uh, back in the day, way back in the day. And so I did not know he that. Had, he had season tickets in the Letterman section, and so uh, all my family, uh, OU grads, my parents, yeah. and. So I, I went to games there as a little kid. How excited is this group to finally just get a chance to open up conference play? Oh, yeah. I mean, that's, that's uh, why you play. I have a chance to compete uh, for a championship. And, you know, this first year we, we want to set our culture and the foundation and all the things that we're instilling. But you also get, we want to get in the fight, get in the Big 12 and get in the fight and see right where we're at. You know, uh, the team we're about to face is one – four straight Big 12s sure. and uh, obviously the favorite to do it again so uh, great opportunity. Making his second appearance on Cartwells we have our very own. You know what today Chris is. Kelly. Yes I do. Go ahead you know you're on right now both y'all. Mm -hmm. Yeah <laughs> two weeks in a row. <laughs> I think you're doing this on purpose. Yeah, I think I both am. of you are. I knew, lunch, always the same time. I knew it. I knew it. With the passing earlier this year of Dave Parks, your team honored him with a, a decal on their helmet, and, and you plan to do that again with the second Ring of Honor member that we lost last week in an EJ Hollow. Yeah, both Dave and e, EJ are uh, obviously Ring of Honor guys, but um, Texas Tech Red Raiders through and through, obviously great players, and uh, it's been well documented, but sure. just, I think, an honoring of their memory, um, honoring their families, and um, it's an important part of the culture around here is, is playing for the past players that yeah. have gone on and these two guys that have passed uh, just a small way that we can um, honor them sure. um, on the back of the helmets uh, the entire year. Well, Coach, good luck. What's up, Jay Mark? <laughs> good luck to you this weekend and your home team. You can watch Red Ritter football on Fox. 11 o'clock kick from Norman to open up Trunk Big Club. 12 play. <laughs> Everybody's going to lunch. Mm. Coach Smith. Oh, you crushed it! I'm sorry! Mike right. Ryan, facilities, need some help. Okay, for, for Taylor Cartwells. Peters, I'm Matt Wells. Cartwells, over and out. Brought Guns to up. you by Southwest Bank.